yes, it's, it's never easy. <laughs> it's never easy, but um, I'm happy it went my way. Um, tough competition. Uh, at this point, I'm, I'm one of the elder statesmen, so I've seen everybody that's that's to come, and Africa always has good competitors. Um, so I'm just happy that I came out with the gold. Um, the podium was super talented, everybody over 21 meters. Um, so yeah, I'm relieved. World Championships was three weeks ago. And um, I think now I'm a little bit of a, on an emotional dump because I've been hyped up basically for the past two and a half months. So now I can relax a little bit, go back to training, but I'm, I'm, I'm so grateful. What mindset did you approach the championship with? I just I had to be very direct, so tunnel vision. Um, traveled, what was it, three days ago. Got in, I trained, yesterday rested. I've been to West Africa every year since maybe 2016. So I know the challenges. They never get easy, but I'm, I'm getting a little bit smarter and a little bit more experienced in how to deal with things. So the humidity is always difficult. Sometimes the surface is consistent, but I always think about the fact that my competitors have the same conditions. So just I want to be mature, face the conditions, and do the best I can for the country. So I'm really happy with how it went. Yeah. So um, on the continent, you know, you are the best African Championships, African Games. So how do you keep yourself motivated? That, yeah, you've always won this. I'm motivated because I know people are watching me. I know the younger guys are watching me, even in the competitions. Like, there's there's a big sense of camaraderie and sportsmanship. So, you always want to compete your best. You always want to do better than you did last time. And at the same time, you want to make your people proud. So that's that always motivates me. Uh, every competition is a new challenge. So I always want to stand up and do the best I can. Take your own record just recently. How does it feel making it on the time you have to Very exciting. And, you know, you, all, you get respect from the people that watch you. You get respect from your competitors as well. So, you know, I'm 31 right now. I'm not old, but I'm not young either. So with every season, every competition, I want to make sure I'm doing the right thing. I want to make sure that I'm still progressing and that when people watch me, it's not like they're watching me with their eyes half closed. I want them to be watching excited for what I do. So as I break records and I, I throw PBs and everything like that, it lets me know I'm doing the right thing and that the people watching are excited for me, not feeling pity or anything. <laughs> <laughs> so it's important for me to do it. Yeah. After Championship Olympics, what's your respect for I do my best. So the competitions have gone well. I'm having a little bit more fun these days. So even though it's very important, at the same time, we're sort of entertainers too. So I want my personality to come out a little bit more. But at the same time, I don't want to sacrifice my performance. So you're going to see more fireworks, you're going to see harder throws, and I'm going to have a good time to give people a show. Thank you. Thank you.